was talking about uh, outside, talking about uh, my great uncle Ed Lee. And uh, Ed Lee was famous around Bruton, Alabama, for building a fence around his house made out of whiskey bottles and quick creek cement. Designed to keep the chickens in and his wife out. Two, three. Now, old Uncle Ed Lee, he bad to drink. He couldn't hold a job with just sit there and think. But he had two daughters as both valedictorian. They graduated in May, but they never come back home again. And Ed Lee and his wife. Alone at the house, she held his whiskey above the sink. She poured it all out. Now, Ed Lee said, look here, woman. Now, my job here is done. Packed up his books, was out on the run. Built himself a shack on the Conecuh River. A pretty little place built out of fallen timber. His wife baked him a cake. She said, Daddy, please come home. He said, there's nothing here but us chickens, and we prefer to be alone. Whoa, what kind of chicken is that? them old Norwegian sardines <laughs> and he ordered classic literature from the magazine drank a whole entire bottle of whiskey for every day till a pile of whiskey bottles began to grow in the shade <laughs> he bought himself a sack of that old quick crete cement commenced to build himself a whiskey bottle fence of Evan Williams, <laughs> Jim Bean, Jack Daniels. Oh, I think you know what I mean. Could never could afford stuff like Jamesons and Bushmills. It's cheap whiskey. Like Ten High, Four Roses, Rebel Yell, Kentucky Gentleman. Mm. I don't know if anybody ever been to New Orleans, Louisiana, but the cheapest and most awful whiskey I ever had in my life was this drugstore there called K&B Drugstore. They had their own whiskey. It's called K&B Whiskey. Damn, K&B had whiskey from Mexico and tequila from Kentucky. This is the kind of whiskey he was drinking. <laughs> He got to the bottom of a bottle of old crow. Up, up to heaven, heaven, here we go. And Ed Lee died. It's a sad, sad song. And somebody else lived there these days. Who it is, we don't know. But they got dogs and cats and chickens in the yard. Planning earlier, the damn fence is falling down. You can find a little piece of it. I used to stand about six feet high and ten feet wide last time I saw it. It was underneath an old kudzu vine. Oh my God, I can't believe my eyes. Now you got to go out in the damn line of the woods and get a little piece of the fence because it's still there and I'm telling you about it. That's today. <laughs> and I tried knocking on the door. Nobody answers the door. The air conditioner's running. The TV's on. The cats have all been fed.
in, in honor of my great uncle Ed Lee. <laughs>